What are you doing? For all of you non-Navy vets out there, that was Morse code for, hi, welcome to Flight Test. I'm Josh, and this is Josh. Hi! And today, why'd you do that? I don't know. Today we're using lasers, laser technology. Laser beams. Something really cool that we laser found out about. Beams. Austin Powers, remember? Yeah. Laser beams. Yep. Man, he is such a distraction to this show. My mom doesn't let me play with lasers, so don't tell her. Okay. We learned a really cool way to balance your props using lasers and mirrors. From this guy right here. The guy holding the uh, microphone. The boom mic, Wayne. He doesn't like to be on camera, so he's hating this right now. A little awkward right now. Wayne, where did you learn it? Uh, YouTube. 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 You learned it from YouTube. Well, let's learn how it works. Yeah, absolutely. Now, have you ever seen the effects of Allen Balance props? Like maybe on an H Quad episode? Jitterbugs. Jitterbugs. Jello. J E L L O. I am That's having as much trouble as I got following you right now. I had too much Mountain Dew today. Okay. But Jello, you, you, you advance the throttle, you're flying your quads, your tries, and it's just, you get this wavy jittery, jello. nasty jello all okay. over the place. And I'm on, I'm, we're on the same page now. The, the H quad was really bad. Okay. It was horrendous because I didn't balance up my props before. I had three bladed on, I moved it to, it was just bad. Gotcha. It was bad. So this will take care of it. Okay. Because what we're doing is we're taking something that you can't see and we're making it visible. We're right. taking the vibrations and, and able to visualize them now. Right, exactly. What we've done, we have a tricopter here. Yep. And we put a little mirror right here. Yes. On that's the arm. just no little mirror. That's a special little mirror. But you guys can all get them. Looks like you just cut like an eighth out of a CD. Kind of. It, it's a single surface mirror. It's it's actually the mirror surface is on the very front of it. And okay. the way you can tell whether a mirror has a surface behind or in front is by touching it with a pen or a screwdriver tip. If the tips meet, oh. then the mirror surface on the front. If it doesn't, then the mirror surface is on the back. And that's important for this. It is important because it gives you a nice clean reflection. Okay. Now, if you don't get it, you'll get a double image. It's not really bad because what a we're- double image? No, double. Oh. Double image. And it's not a bad thing. You just basically the whole desire is actually whatever you have reflected when the motor's at rest, yeah. you want that to stay the same. Okay. So if you have a double image, it's not the end of the world. All right, and we also have a uh, laser right here. Yep. Mounted to the table. Yep. And now this is uh, this is actually one that shoots a line. And uh, what, what uh, Wayne did is he actually just blocked it off with the dot. Okay. You can also use the cool little Morse code thing yeah. that you're using. Right. Just don't play with it so much that it runs out of batteries. Don't shine in your friend's eyes either. Yeah, it'll blind the audience too. So you gotta be careful. All right, are you ready to try it? Well, let's do it, let's do okay. it. Let's go and power off. Now what we did is we're gonna do one motor at a time. Don't try to do all of your motors at one point because you're not singularizing, singular, you're not singling everything out. Here comes out. a new Josh Bixler word. New Josh Bixler word. You're not singling any motor out. You wanna do one motor at a time so you know that you get each and every motor as smooth running as possible. Okay. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, we'll power this out. We only have one motor actually activated. Right. And as you can see, we have it lifted off the table just slightly. That way it can move around, okay? Once again, the dot can move, but you don't want the dot to be blurry, okay? Right. So I'm gonna be holding this down. I'm gonna probably be bumping a little bit and the dot's okay. gonna wander. Right. What we're gonna want is just the vibrations that the dot's doing. Right, we want the dot to be as close to a dot as possible. Exactly, you wanna fire that up and we're gonna get the mural. Good, let's, let's All go. All right, here. we have our dot. Our you guys got there? Yep, and we're gonna go ahead and down to the right. And As you can see, that's bad. Our dot turned into a... Uh, a line. A big line. Yep. Now what we're doing is we're making a vibration visible. It's just right before your eyes. Isn't that cool? Yeah. Now we have a line now. Here's half throttle. As you can see, uh -oh. it's even more of a line. So we don't want that. We want it to look like a dot. Right. Or as close to a dot as possible. Exactly. So what you want to do now is you're going to want to add tape or remove tape to your prop while it's dynamically getting balanced. So okay. otherwise while it's spinning. Right. Best way to balance the motor is while it's spinning because that's what it's going to be doing when it's flying. You want to put tape on it while it's spinning? No. Oh. No. We're going to stop the motors, preferably turn it off, and we're going to add or remove tape. Okay. All right. Now, why don't you go ahead and take off that really big, big honking one? piece of okay. tape there. Sure. Perfect. Thank you for not running it up all this time. You are quite welcome, my friend. All right, so we got our dot again. Got it. And here we go. A lot better. A lot better. Where are you at? There we go. About half? Yep, yeah, it's just about half. Nice. That's nice. 
Okay. And you know what's funny, when I'm feeling it, you can barely feel any vibration in this. It feels really good. Yeah. Now, the little motion you are seeing is actually my hand trembling because there's a tricopter running indoors. Yeah. Right, yeah. Right. I'll see if I can hold it still. There. Okay. There you go. That's a dot. Once again, nice. that's what it looked like before. And after. So I like that. That's a keeper. Awesome. What you want to do is you want to do this three times over. And if you have a hexaceptocopter, how many times will we do it? Uh, seven million times. Plus two. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So we've learned how to dynamically balance a prop using a laser. Visually. Visually. In a, in a mirror. Those beeps are driving me crazy. Okay, I'll turn it off for you. Okay. But it's a great little tip. It is a great tip. And you know what? It's very useful also for FPV airplanes because what you can do is like say my EPP FPV. My EPP FPV. My EPP, my, my airplane level, or the Twin Star. Yeah. Okay. You can put that mirror where the GoPro is going to be. Okay. And you can balance and run up your motors and, and actually see what your GoPro is feeling. Oh, nice. Which is a really nice feature. You don't have to go on each booms. You can use it on airplanes too. Yeah. It's basically a tool that will take vibrations away or may help you visualize vibrations so you can address them. So you can minimize them. Exactly. All exactly. right. So I would do all three and then probably put it where your camera is going to be. Okay. And then go ahead and make sure everything's good and go fly and have fun. Very cool. Get rid of the jello. All right. No jello. Oh no. All right. Well, thank you guys for watching. Thanks to Stonecat Productions for sponsoring this episode. And check out our website, flighttest.com. Rate the articles. Rate the articles. Love the articles. Go to the forum. And also, so you guys have been doing a great job about calling manufacturers too. Yeah. Yeah, you guys are you, you heard the call to duty and you you heard and you do acted on it. That's right. That's a good way to say it. You acted on it. Mm -hmm. So thank you because manufacturers are calling us. They want to see their product on yeah. the shows. 100 percent because of you guys. Yeah, so, so thank keep you. it up. Thank yeah, you keep very it much. up. Don't light up on them. Yeah. Alright, we'll see you guys next, see you next time. time. I'm gonna fly this. Okay. There we go. Yeah. It's all balanced. Yeah, it is all balanced. Yeah. Laser beams. Yep.